Dear Mariners, welcome to my channel The Sailing Beast. Please like, share and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the bell icon for updates on upcoming videos. In this video we will discuss Disconnectable internal turret mooring systems Optionally, mooring and riser systems are available that can be disconnected from the turret. The disconnectable turret uses a buoy that is locked into a receptacle located at the lower end of the turret. The buoy provides support to the risers and mooring lines when disconnected. The buoyancy of the buoy matches the weight of the risers and mooring lines to ensure equilibrium at the required submerged depth. In ice covered Arctic waters, the disconnection might be required while the mooring lines are highly tensioned in one direction. This asymmetrical mooring load can cause jamming of the buoy when it is disconnected. The Arctic turret offers a two step disconnection mechanism to avoid this problem. In the first step the buoy is lowered below the hull while the mooring lines remain attached to the turret. In the second step the mooring lines are released to allow disconnection. The mooring lines are also connected to the buoy using jumper lines, to ensure that the mooring lines remain attached to the buoy in submerged position.